Okay, hello my friend and how are you doing? And then I am planning to tell you that how works this fan computer and why this device is very important if we have any issues and bad things in our, our cars, this air condition system. And now we, we might have car like Ford car, Servolet car, or then like German Mercedes-Benz car, and also this Toyota car. And we might have this, that fun computer, what is very important thing, because this fun computer controls this radiator's fan. And why it is so important if we have air condition system? Let's go to look. Okay. There is thing that when we insert this on, when we turn on this our air condition system, there is compressor in this engine area. And this compressor starts to rotate this uh, air condition, uh, this liquids and gas through these hoses in here. There are those hoses. And then when we are driving in very high temperature uh, day in highway, this our system becomes so hot that there is this that radiator panel. This is air conditions radiator and cooler. That uh, that thing and we can see that this aluminium pipes goes to that radiator and that air condition radiator's purpose is to heat away this hot air what is inside in our cabin area and that's this part is sometimes very high when we are driving very slow way in highways and that we need extra this fan and here we have this fan propeller in here and this fan propeller moves air through that area that area through that radiator and also that car's radiator in here. And it cool down also this air conditioner radiator and cooler and also this car engine's radiator. And then how it works? There is this part in here, that part where we can see those aluminium uh, lines in here. This is fan computer and this part decides that when this big white fan is moving like that and this computer controls also this air condition system's heat level and this compressor level and then also this engine's level and this idea is that that when this fan, fan is moving it cool down also this air condition system and also this car engine's radiator system. And that's this computer is, is very important. And if we have situation that we are in, in like Los Angeles, this rush hours, and we are standing in highway, and we think that now this our air condition system is not working well, there is maybe thing that this fan is not moving because that computer thinks that that our air condition level is okay and and then we can think that 
this computer is bad and we have to replace that. And this is this information that why this air, this uh, air condition belongs to this car's radiator fan. Put this in here. And then there is this fan computer in here. And next I like to show that how we can replace that fan, con fan computer unit. And let's look that. Okay, and here we have this fan computer unit. And then remember that when we are trying to open these bolts, be very carefully. Because now I made mistake that that another bolt in here, in that area, because they, these screws, sorry, these screws are so high, so tight that I used my little bit wrong side, this screwdriver, and I damaged now this, my screw in here. And that's when we are opening these screws, please use very accurate, just suitable, this screwdriver. And then, then we can open these screws, because now I made to myself big job big job, extra job, because now I have to drill out this my this uh, screw in here and then then I have to purchase new similar screw in Toyota dealership center. But now I I was a little bit wiser in that another area and and, and I have in here big collection of different kind of these screw Philips screw bites and that one is very good and then I can show that what is this right way to open this bolt and now I press that in down down in here and then I rotate that in this way and here is screw what looks like that. And now this another part is away, but I I damage that another screw in here. Look. And now when I am trying to open it, I can't open it because there is now a slippery. Look. Let's go to take closer view. They're slippery and and now I can't open that bolt and that means now that that I have to drill out this screw and then I have to install in here new screw but this is this idea that how I can replace this this computer unit and I rotate a little bit that my part, that we can see what is this part. There is this, um, there is this part name is this computer unit, and then a little bit more light. There is text computer cooling fan there. Okay, this is this unit what I have to replace if I have issues in my fan control. And now I mean that this fan control is this fan in here. Okay, but now I have to say that I managed to open only one screw and I hope that you are more lucky because these screws take away, takes my time about one hour. But this was, this was this information. Okay, thank you my friend and see you in the next movie.